be Pyro, Mithra, Lucina the whole time. And getting yeah, right yeah, into yeah. It. No, no one's going to switch off. Getting right into it. Hollow Bastion. Oh, wow, you guessed it. How did I do it? Wow. Both of these characters, very long swords, pretty solid hitboxes. And uh, they're just going to be trading hits in the neutral here. Mr. B Ooh, getting great a little conversion. down in percent, however. Kuma, Kuma actually kind of controlling the pace of this game. Good roll Ooh. by Mr. B. Yeah, doesn't get hit by the s mass. That's going to be a little bit critical, giving uh, Mr. B the stage control and sending off Kuma to the ledge. Blazing and gonna knock him away. I but... hate that move so much, by the way. Hey, just get good. <laughs> no, it's it's so it's not a good move. It's and just Meech to station one. Hat anyway, and Meech station I'm gonna stop one. complaining on commentary and instead. So oh, the reason, oh, oh, what? Ooh. I actually didn't know that had a multi hit. I also didn't. However, one thing I want to point out is that uh, Kuma is doing a really really good job at Can maintaining stage Jim control Blue here. To station like three. right now is the first time, pretty much in the whole game that Mr. B's been able to get stage control on there. He loses it just again. But Kuma's in this uh, percent lead simply because he four, has more options in neutral from the stage four. Oh, I thought, I thought Kuma oh. wasn't going to make it back. Mr. B actually definitely could have made that back. Did he? Oh, oh, what a counter. And the footstool. Let's I go. I don't think that was intentional, I but if it was. was, I mean, if it was, it was. That look, actually, I don't know. I saw Mr. B shrugging, but that could have been a shrug of, well, I guess that worked, or that could have been a shrug of. Yeah, it seemed like that. a we take those kind of shrugs, or like, oh, I guess I got a stop. Oh, that dancing blade one leading to so much more damage. Very, very good conversion here. However, Kuma just gonna fire right back. 77 to 66. Yeah, Kuma getting that grab with the fade back run away. Mr. B able to go pound for pound with a lot of these really, really talented players. He just needs Ooh, to be able to close it out. Have a right jump? here yep. is an opportunity for him to do just that. I would have been scared right there if uh, Mr. B got hit by the up B. Could have had to potentially tech against the wall. Oh, and oh, that, that back, back air. air is going to just send him Ew. right off the top. I that was gross. Like that. Yeah. that was gross. Kuma just using stage control so well right now. Good nair from Kuma. Kuma yeah, does have um, the stock lead, but not really at the percent. Ooh, oh, man. And the multi -hit. Okay. These down smashes Dang have been like kind of big brain because Mr. B has either been um, Very good recovery carrying. by Kuma. What? Very good recovery by Kuma. Yeah. yeah, either Mr. B has been parrying the first hit but has not been parrying the second hit or has just been Can like, I dropping shield. Can Paradox to Station 6? Do good set there. Paradox and Station Mr. 6. Mr. B going to take it up before taking 69% of his own. Nice. Yeah. Um, but Kuma still has a pretty solid lead. Like you were saying earlier, Kuma's been doing really well with stage control, and that's going to be a really part. Of, that's going to be a good part of the matchup. Mr. B though has uh, Kuma above him. Going to send these away. These dancing blades are really good, netting him so much. Oh, and can Mr. B actually get the stock right here if he can? That's very good for him. Oh, Mr. B trying to look for the back air oh, right there. That dash attack just missing, but. This ledge shot by Mr. B. Yeah, I was about to say, Mr. B has a lot of the momentum. That downer is going to swing the momentum oh. in Kuma's favor. Sends him off stage. What are we going to see? He's going to fade he for the He went back. for that, and I can't believe that didn't hit. That F tilt, oh. though, nice. is Sailor that? Sailor Jess and Coronet to station five. Oh, Sailor Jess oh. and, oh. Jess and, and Mr. Five. B, he gets those. Let's go. Good job, Mr. B. Taking game one in a very in a trade fashion. I honestly yeah. thought he might have been the one to lose that, but... He doesn't. I thought. I thought that. Um. I thought that. Kuma wouldn't have been able to recover anyway, but it looked like he was going to. But that was just a really well timed back air for Mr. B to hit on the recovery from Kuma. Even like it traded, but it didn't matter because of, like the priority in the attacks that, oh uh, the back air just like hits harder, so it just sent it, um yeah. first, and then got the kill off of it, which is crucial. Um, did you see the counterpick stage, or? I did not. Okay, well, we'll see it in a second. Um, Might have been Hollow Bastion again. Kuma staying. Stay. Yeah, Mr. B is definitely going to stay. I no, would not expect no Kuma problem to switch there. here. Uh, Pyro Method, definitely his best character at the moment. Okay, just pray that Kuma did not go to Beville. To Beville? Yeah, don't, don't go know. to Beville. Hollow Bastion. Okay, yeah, it's back to it's it, it's pretty back to much Beville, man. Yeah, but it's not true Be Beville. True. Got up tilt, and Mr. B going into this game with the momentum. Let's see what Kuma does about that. Did that shield poke? I think Mr. B might have just dropped shield. But it might have. Getting a very solid percent lead here. 
Mr. B's ledge trapping was on point that last talk, and that's honestly all he really needed to close it out, but we'll see how it fares against Kuma's uh, monstrous stage control this game. Tries to go for the up. He actually gets no punish. That was a Kuma. very, very smart fall through platform. Kuma was definitely expecting him to land on platform. Didn't get a punish because of that. Might have just had to like read the option. So I mean, it, it's a, it takes a little time for you to recognize if they're actually going to do it. Out and Mr. B going to be able to get ledge. Yeah, good tomahawks on off stage. Not really. Oh, actually gets reversed, but oh. not too big of a deal. Oh, that yeah. was a good punish by Mr. B. Dashing exactly the right amount to catch Kuma with his up smash. And it's going to put Brandon, or not, uh, yeah, Mr. B. Mr. B, sorry, in the lead. I mean, that's going to work wonders. Uh, Mr. B has had the momentum a lot in this set. So if he can just keep um, keep that momentum going forward and get the set up, I mean, he'll have a really good win under his belt. Oh, yeah. Mr. B has come so close to beating really, really good players of this caliber so many times. And I think he has, he has a lot of really good wins. He's got a Just Blue win. He's got many, many PR wins. But if he gets this Kuma win here, this will be the crown jewel on his collection. Yeah, that good still will take it, yeah. yeah. 43, That's... not too much for Kuma, but Mr. B is going to look to keep this lead, and that grab yeah. is going to make it so that Kuma... I think this is where we need to see Kuma really uh, stand out in this set. Uh, he needs to really get the momentum back. Oh, man, he got that good down tilt Speaking catch. Of momentum, yeah. Into F smash, but that's gonna keep the pressure up with that forwarder knocks Mr. B off stage. Good nair by Mr. B. Mr. B uses Lucina nair better than anyone I've seen. To be fair, I haven't seen that many Lucinas play, but you, we can both agree that it's still like very, very impressive. Oh, good blazing end. Kuma has taken this percent lead back. Um, still even stocks right now. Kuma has a lot of momentum in the second stock. We'll just have to see how it goes. Yeah. Oh. Yeah, good fade back. He spaced that out so yeah. well, Mr. B. Nothing he could do there, really. Oh, that would have been awesome if he uh -oh, hit that. Oh, he got... Release. He with the button. Now he's going to die. Because <laughs> that's what happens when you play against Mithra. Oh. Oh. oh barely spaced. F-Smash going to take it. I mean, come on, man. Yeah, gets an up-smash. Those three up tilts by Kuma. What was that? Mithras. Okay, come on, but like up till it's pretty safe. It, so. it, it, no, it was absolutely safe. Uh -huh. That's what I'm saying. The issue is Mr. B could do nothing about it. Yep. Great tomahawk. Excellent tomahawk. Kuma's gonna send him off stage. All yep. Mr. B needs here is one good. Oh, garden. just barely whiffs on the the down air up smash. I don't know if that's gonna be like the biggest cost of the set right now. Is Kuma not getting that conversion? If Kuma does it, if Kuma loses, it's because he didn't get that conversion. Mr. B is getting a lot of momentum back right here. He's racking up the damage, getting a lot of these hits in. Kuma's not really answering back. Oh, almost shield breaks. Oh, he tries to go for the S smash. It's not gonna oh. hit this time. Oh, yeah. and down Kuma air. will get the down air to up air. Yeah, down air, up air, gonna seal that out. To make this a game three. Remember, this is not even winner's right quarters. This is, yeah, this is, this is the. Winners. This is only Eight? top 16. Oh my god. Yeah, this is this is winner's side top 16. That's insane, dude. Just goes to show you how stacked this is. And just how many people are here. Yeah. <laughs> well, we have the small intuition. Let's see if there are any upsets. Um, Unleashed beat Brevity 2-0. Oh, nothing surprising there. Yeah. I can see it. Um, <sighs> DM and Frosty getting the rematch from Tuesday. Oh yeah, because uh, Frosty beat Frosty DM, and it wasn't even close, man. Okay, I didn't. Lie. Was that? Yeah, actually, At I didn't. At you, Frosty two owed him, and I think it was like two two stocks. Jesus. It was. It was. Intense. Was it, what was? Who was DM playing as? Uh, it was Pika. And Interesting. He went Pika game one, Pyramithra game two. Wow. Okay, but who cares about that? We got Mister Being Cool. Hey, game look three. Run, look around. Come here. On the run back to Hall Bastion again. Great up tilt, just spacing well. Parry turn around, tries to go for the dash attack. Mr. B actually recognizing that. Go for the air dodge swiftly and make sure you don't get hit again. Good spot dodge by Mr. B. He knew his shield no was low. No way. Not going to kill. Going to bring him pretty close. 88 to 22. Kuma taking this percent lead early on here, and we'll just have to see what he does with it. Yeah. I really like that down air. Down air on this platform is really good because it reaches below, and Lucina is like kind of tall, so it can really clip can people under the platform, and then one. they'll just hat get and hit, run. spiked, station and then one. hit by a smash. Great grab by Lucina, and this this juggle could be what he needs, Ooh. but kind of get up tilted. Yeah, solid first stock from Kuma, making this three to two right now. We need to see Mr. B uh, milk get some momentum back. Two. He wants a chance to set. Station two.
Mr. B getting a little bit of whip punish. Uh, Kuma is setting this game up right now. 49% on. Oh, tries to go for the F-Tilt, does not get anything off of it. Dob Smash not going to do it. I personally would have gone for F-Smash there to send him off stage, but Mr. B thinking he might be able to get the kill. And ooh, good down smash. Kuma rolls just out of it. Yeah, range. it was just slightly mis uh, misspaced. Uh, I, don't, I don't disagree with the down smash, though. Oh, absolutely not. That's one of Mr. B's signature moves. Uh, does he have a jump? He does. Ooh, oh, no good oh. side beat. Oh, I was about to say, there's no punish there, but it actually gets hit by the, the last hit of... That was uh, a really basically. good drift in and switch to Pyra. No way. Yeah. Nah, that move kills really late. Oh, good neutral B. Yeah, Kuma able to recover back to ledge, but this is where Mr. B gets a little scary. What's the option for Kuma to get back? Actually going to roll in, but Kuma's just going to get sent off stage once again. Yeah. And good back air to catch the switch. Mr. B down 108%, Station however. 17 and up are good for friendlies. 17 and up, good for friendlies. Oh, Another tomahawk. These tomahawks are just eating, eating Mr. B up. Yeah, because at this percent, you really don't want to get hit by like one of these stray um, aerials or like an F tilt or up tilt. Um, so he's basically just conditioning Mr. B. But I mean, that yeah. F tilt's going to take it. Kuma is now up two stocks to one on Let's Hall see what Mr. B can do, though. Let's see what Mr. B can do. Yep. No jump. No jump. No. Yes. Side B's oh, going to do it. Got it. This is great, an even game. Mr. B Mr. was B. slightly behind, but he's actually brought this back. Good roll in. This is where and we're going to see who's going to top it. Yeah. Who is the clutch? And who is the crutch? Oh, 69. Mr. B back on stage. Getting the, uh, a couple little strings. Getting this back air in there. Blazing end. Oh. Crowd's getting a little rowdy. Oh, the F tilt? Mr. B with slight percent lead, only about a 60% difference. Let's see what's going to happen. Looks like Kuma's just going to stay on Pyro. Those tomahawks? Yep. Kuma's just going to stay on Pyro right here. No reason not to at this point, no. You need to, you need to send him away. Wants Switches the speed actually so he can Mithra. get stage. Oh! A smash. Catch the light. Gonna take it. Yeah. And a oh, heartbreaker for Mr. B. Such a good match. Like I said, Mr. B always bringing the hype. Very, very close, but...